We back. I don't know how to start off this video, but this one was just randomly. It just came out random. Um, those of you guys, I know a lot of you guys see this already. You guys already know I make videos about guns when I do vlogs. But with the title of the video, you see what the new purchase is. So hopefully you guys will stay tuned to this video because I know a lot of you guys are Glock fanatics as myself. I wouldn't cop anything else besides maybe one or two things, but that are pistols. But this one here, this is the new EDC. It's gotta be. Make sure y'all do like this video, subscribe to the channel, continue watching the videos. I do reaction videos if you guys do music. Recommend in the comment section and I'll make one out for you guys. But let's get into the video. Sorry about the setup, uh, setting up for my shit. It's crazy. You guys see it. No, oh, I ain't going to show you that. I ain't going to show you this box or the bottom one. You see two boxes. You already know they're Glock boxes. That is my current EDC, which is my Glock 19. And the next one is in the box on the bottom that I'm about to show you. That bag there is more ammo. I'll show you that too because it's different ammo. And I want you guys to ping to see what you guys think of that kind. How does it work for you guys? And yeah, I gotta try. I gotta try stop setting it up as if I was to make a reaction video because I kind of every time I do a reaction video, I set myself up to one side. But this one here, all lies on Daddy. Oh, shit, lies. <laughs> <sighs> Pause. Hey, 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 hey. But yeah, you guys already know my Glock 19. I put the stock one on because. Just to show you guys, this here is a Glock. For those of you guys that are new or don't know nothing about the Glock 19, uh, first time I'm gonna speak on it again. Second time I'll speak on it because first one when I first bought it. So, Glock 19, everything stock, rail, everything, the trigger. The only thing I did to this gun was I put the beam on. The beam. Uh, let me, matter of fact, I'm gonna take this out because it's loaded. And yeah, don't need that. Okay, so yeah, Just showing you guys, empty. Anyway, but yeah, that's the only thing I really did to it. Um, I'm not gonna do nothing else to it. So those of you guys don't don't know, I did want to probably change. It's possible to change these out, right? These little sights, these little iron sights, because. Yeah, it's possible. I just haven't done it or not going to yet. But if you guys also don't know, I am, by the time you guys are probably watching this, I probably already went to my concealed carry class, trying to get my license for that. Um, trying to do it the best way I can, you know? Because why not have concealed carry and be straight? You know, whenever anything needs to go down, it's gonna go down the legal way. But yes, enough of this Glock 19. This is, was my ultimate favorite pistol I always wanted to get, and I got it now. Ain't nothing beating it. Just saying that. Who knows? Near future, I might buy more of it, more Glocks. Recommend what Glock you guys like. Or if you guys got one, what kind is it? If you guys got a 19, drop a 19 in the comment section. But let me know what kind you guys got that, so that you guys have as an EDC. EDC, if you guys don't know, is everyday carry. The ones you always got on with you. So. If you guys got different recommendations on pistols like Taurus, Canic, Hellcat, um, Smith & Weston, whatever it is, drop in the comment section. But I want to see what kind of flavor you guys got in, in guns too. But yeah, this one here, Glock 19, it did come with the two stock magazines. Came with a lock, um, the barrel cleaner, uh, what else it come with? Instructions. Um, I did buy it new. It ran me about, it was about almost $600, $600, um, which is cheap to me. And I don't know what your guys' budget and for a gun will be, but I did see another one. It, if you guys don't know The Walking Dead, Rick Grimes, you seen that big ass pistol, that, what was it? A Python or whatever you want to call it, gun. They had it in black with carbon fiber, bro. And the price was unbeatable. It was a, it was, if you guys, what if you, if we get, look, straight up by the end of the month, if we get 20 likes on this video, I'm gonna go copy. Now drop a video in about, you'll see. If we get 20 likes, I'm gonna go copy. Hopefully it's still there. So make sure let's get running out 20 likes today. Once it drops 20 likes, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go copy. 
I'm a man of my word. Because I'm a man. Enough for the Glock 19. Now we are on to the Glock 43. I've seen, my re I've seen reviews of what's the difference. And I'm about to speak on this one right now. Glock 43. 43. You can see that. Glock 43. I'm not going to show you the other side because that's what the serial number is. Uh, it's already loaded. I'm going to take it out. These bullets, bro. I'm going to show you them because they're new. Empty. I don't know why I'm doing that. But yeah. Glock 43. It's not the 43X. And I will tell you guys the difference right now. What I like about this. Look at the size of it in my hand. It's a little bit too small. But that's the whole point. I guess all Glock 43s come with two magazines. Six round each. And it comes with this little pinky extender, which works out for me because my hand is a little bit big. But this gun here is and could be my new EDC. It's small, light compared. Hold on. Let me take out the magazine off the uh, 19 and show you guys the difference between these two. Everyday carry new one look at the difference in size the difference in size is crazy you see the size different in hand where you put your grip it where you grip it barrel length 19 and also in the 43 difference um the by the thickness and by the thinness of the barrel also, because this one chambers in 15 plus one in the, in the head, this 43 does six rounds plus one in the head, which is seven, but, and it's a single stack. So if you guys look at Glock 19, 43. 19 carries 15 side to side, Glock 43, single stack. It's only six, six rounds. Also the difference, in size, thickness. That is the reason why this 43 could be potentially, potentially be the next EDC because it is so lightweight. Uh, I believe an EDC should be, my opinion should be the lightweight, the lightest it can be. No, ex no, nothing to it, just what it, what it has. I was really, honestly, in my opinion, I was really thinking about looking into getting a extended mag for the 43, but in reality, like realistically, it, the biggest one I've seen was a 12 round, which I don't think is necessary, but just to have it, just to look cool with it, but to have it as an EDC and having it everywhere with you is not the way to go. Just stick to your stock uh, magazines that you have get with the uh with the brand because those are the ones that you should rely on the most don't rely on pro mag pro mag uh umex whatever everything else is called you cannot rely on those because those are not uh those are not the brand for the those are not i don't know how to explain it bro but the ones that come with the mag just stick to those because those are the ones that are guaranteed to not jam but glock is already known for no jams only peanut butter it's butter because it came out smooth they don't jam for nothing and that's why i like glock me personally i've always liked Glock just the way it the brand the, the way it looks the way it feels pause it's the best now i know i got another one coming <laughs> even the even the even the shop owner he told me is that what's my uh if there's anything else that i don't need so I said, I am already looking into one. I'm gonna talk about it later. And he's like, all right. So yeah, shout out to Swats Guns. Definitely dope. Appreciate you guys for hospitality. You guys always show love, especially with coming with the shit quick. Fuck with it. That's what other company am I gonna fuck with, bro? But yeah, let me know what you guys do think about the 43X. 
rated from 10 to 10 being fire, deserving trash. I said in all my videos, but let me know what you guys do think about this. Was this a good purchase? Because to me, honestly, it's lightweight, which is a big plus. Pocket rocket, bro. There's a pocket rocket, but don't pocket rocket nothing unless you got it in your hip. What is it? IWB? OWB? You guys know what I'm talking about. But really, the only thing I would add on to this will be a flashlight or a beam. And that's that's all it's going to get onto it. There's nothing more to it. Maybe customize it. Who knows? You guys let me know. Comment, recommend it. In the comment section, what do you guys think I should be doing with these pistols? Because, like I said, I got a four rack. A four rack for the, for the guns to sit on. Um, I'll show you guys right now. Because I now, really, I need two. Well, I still need three more. Let's just keep it like that. But if you guys love Glock, let me know what you guys think because I have no issues with it. No issues with them at all. The parts, nothing breaking on it. Everything is my 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 perspective, my perspective best gun out there. Glock, shout out Glock. Uh, but yeah. Big chilling on the bed. This is what I was gonna show you guys. Obviously, you guys already know this is the one I always got on me. Uh, AR-15 magazine, which you guys probably can't see. It's sitting right down there. Um, let me move this off the way. But like I said, this is a four hole, uh, four rag holder. One, two, three, four. There's the 19. And then this one might be a little bit tricky because it's small. Actually, matter of fact, no, it's not. Look. Hell yeah. So now, really, I need two more to fit in these two. And that's pretty much it. I'm gonna put the uh, the other one in here, the other magazine for the, the 43 in here, just to keep them in there. Or matter of fact, uh, let me show you guys the ammo real quick, because I will be probably putting the ammo in here. So yeah, that's the 43 and the 19. Let me know what you guys think. Another one I should be getting. But on to the next. Every you know, every time I go buy a gun, I end up buying ammo. Got to. The more you, the more guns you add on you have to have more ammo because what's the point of having so many guns and no ammo? I mean, honestly, I don't know how what other way to say it, but it don't make no sense. But yeah, uh, I did buy more ammo. Let me know what you guys do think of it. I bought it for $30, 20 rounds. Um, these are Federal Premium. Uh, these are Hydro Shock Deep, 135 grain, 20. Look at the way they expand. Looks like a little crown. And these do look a lot more different than the ones I already got. Um, so I might switch those out for these. I don't know, I always do that every time I get new, uh, new ammo. Switch it out. But these are the new ones. This is what they look like. They're like a whole, like a whole little flower in there. Yeah. These are pretty clean. Um, there's not really any difference between this one and the one I already have on my EDC. The only thing different is just the little, the way it looks in the tip, pause. Um, that's the only thing different. I did buy three boxes. Uh, that's all they had actually. They only have three boxes, but I'm still looking into more. I'm, I'm not even, I'm probably, I'm not even buying the same, the kind of same amount. Um, I'm not even buying the same kind of ammo, but, uh, I'm looking into different kinds, you know, just to see which one uh, is the best, what kind you guys recommend, you guys think is the best. I know a few of you guys did already on my, on my Instagram, you guys hit me up. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, link in the description. I do post more on there about everything I do and have. Just not everything goes on YouTube. Don't know why. But if you guys like this video, if you guys learned something or enjoyed it, like this video. Like I said, if I get 20 likes, I will go cop that um, revolver that I seen it look kind of I don't know if it's the same one or if it's kind of like Rick Grimes Python gun that he had in the, in the show but in black and I believe it was like carbon fibers bro it was dope cheap price but if I can get that 20 likes today as soon as it drops I'm gonna go copy it mandatory never had a never had a revolver be cool to have it in the collection you guys, it's up to you guys. Like I said, bro, appreciate every single one of you guys that does support my channel because without you guys, I wouldn't even have bought any guns, bro. Let's be honest. I really wouldn't. But with YouTube, things do come um, with price. 
because good thing I do have these. I've had incidents where I almost had to use my shit because I'm starting to get noticed. I know a lot of you guys are like, dude, you're not even that big on YouTube, but in reality, the exposure I'm getting from the artist and me promoting myself out here in my town, my city, people recognize and people don't like it because people don't like to, people don't like to um, see others do better than, than themselves, you know? So if someone does something good for themselves or for the community, people automatically hate you or don't want to see you succeed. And really, this has really saved me a lot. Um, set up, I've been set up, I've been, people have been asking me who I am and shit, like in real life, not because of what I do. But I'm not gonna get too much into that shit, fuck all that. No negativity, all positivity on this side. Contra blessings, not your problems. If you guys fuck this video, you guys fuck with me. Subscribe, like the video, share. If you guys love guns, be part of my royalty gang. I love guns too as well. If you guys don't know, check out my previous vlogs. Dope. Other than that, catch on next video. Thank you.